I'm Mika Druma and I've recently started my own studio in Worcester called Mika Druma Architects. We've decided to go with ArchiCAD, it seemed the natural progression having worked on it, or worked with it um, for the last nine years. We focus on small scale residential and offices at the moment, also farm buildings, uh, being based in the Boerland and within a big farming community specializing in new builds as well as alterations and additions and renovations to existing buildings. Um, I believe very strongly in an interactive approach with the client uh, throughout the design process which um, allows for I believe a much better building at the end of the day which is, makes the client happy as well as the architect and anyone else involved in the process and ArchiCAD facilitates this. It's great for playing around options, manipulating it. Um, I would say that's one of my favorite things about ArchiCAD is how flexible it is. Whether I'm working on a small residential project or a big office block on teamwork and um, with a big team underneath me, or with me, I can adjust its tools and its capacity to what I need uh, for each project up to doing custom design furniture when it's able to build up to the tiny parts of that furniture um, on ArchiCAD and use it to your to benefit. So I think the opportunities are endless and there's still so much to learn and explore within ArchiCAD. So I so will admit as well that I often use it to help me with some graphic design things as well, designs, layouts. Um, what do I like most about ArchiCAD 24? I'll say the one thing I'm very excited about is the model comparison. Being somebody who likes exploring various options with the, with a design, um, this now allows me to easier view the different options and be able to compare them next to each other. Um, so that's very exciting and I think it's going to lead to much more refined designs, much more possibilities in how to look at your design and how to change designs and develop them as you as you go along. Also quite excited about the MEP tools. Um, it would be quite nice to play around with that and set up your services within a small house for example, see where they clash, where they don't, how it fits into your, your design. Um, especially a lot of clients if you're going more industrial route, they want things exposed. Um, how can you show that? So that, I think, is going to be an added benefit, especially when you don't have a mechanical electrical engineer on board the project. I have been using ArchiCAD for about the last nine years. It was actually the first 3D program that I started off with, and it took a bit of getting used to in the beginning, like anything, but once you get onto it, it's, it's quite addictive, and it's great to just learn about it every day, how, how it works and what you can do with it. Um, I think there's so much more to still learn that I'm not even aware of. Um, because if you work on small scale projects, you don't always need the complex um, functions that ArchiCAD can do. Yet, knowing that those options are around for a big project in day is, is great. And the fact that you can apply those complex functions to a small project as well.